supposed to main it early here back with a new video you know what i'm saying so spark recall <clears throat> excuse me still sleeping spark recall we about to get that new sprocket put on today my appointment is today and uh yeah i'm up here at freedom power sports in louisville texas you know what i'm saying so we about to go up in here drop the keys off and i'm gonna take a nap boy yeah How you doing, sir? I'm good. What's up? Got this bracket recall appointment today. Oh, okay. For the recall, what he's got to do is he's going to have to uh, remove your rear wheel and so he can get the belt off, and then he's going to uh, take that front sprocket off. All right. So uh, basically, it's just held on by a bolt of washer, and then it's uh, it's the splines are so tight, should be there's no there's no lock tight or anything. It's just stuck on there. So he's going to have to use a puller to pull it off. Hopefully, there's no damage. You know, that's what they're preventing. So he'll uh, pop the new one on and uh, torque it down to correct specs, and that's it. So you'll have a new, uh, new front. Okay, so just to be sure, there you're not y'all don't use no type of Loctite to put them I'll on a new spark. I'm not sure, but I'm I don't think sure. he does. On it. No. Okay. Reds, and they apply a uh, it's just a retaining compound sealant, which is Loctite. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. So he's got a specific number on there. Yeah, it's a uh, it's a uh, Loctite 609. Okay. It'll be a specific. So yeah, that's how they put it on. I know a lot of y'all want to know how they putting it on, uh, details about it and stuff like that. So yeah, they are putting it on, like you said, with the washer and they using Loctite. Uh, you saw Loctite at the bottom. So ETA is an hour. ETA is about an hour. Damn, so close to my face. ETA is about an hour. And uh, I'm gonna show some of these bikes in here real quick. Before I go take me a nap. So, got some new stuff in here. I still like this lime green, John. This lime green, John, hard. But after a while, I have to change the color though. Got you another RT. And then we got your F3 Limited right here. RT F3 it should be F3T I think another yeah, RT what this tag say I think it's an F3T what this say oh it's a limited I was wrong my fault it's a limited F3 I mean an RT RT and that F3S 20 bands we got the right boys over here. Boom, boom, boom. What is this? That's 900, 900, 900. Yeah, all they got in here is 900. 900. 900. Yep, 900. We ain't got no, no, no little 600s in here, baby, y'all. 900s. So, Powers, Louisville, Powers, uh, shoot. Freedom Motors, Freedom Power Sports in Louisville. Boy, I can go sleep. Yeah, I want to get y'all some bikes. Y'all looking at getting a bike. Come right here, check out these can downs. I got your Harleys in here. You know what I'm saying? Sorry, they got the Harleys in here. And, uh, I got other stuff in here too. That's a KTM right there. CBRs. Whatever you want. They got stuff in here. You know what I'm saying? I might give me a four wheel. I ain't gonna lie to you. I might give me a give me a four wheel. Alright y'all, we back. I ain't turning on when I got done with I just came straight to the crib. But this is what it like. That's the new sprocket right there. Uh, and uh yeah, black. It's not longer black, now it's silver. And you probably can't see from the side, but it is a little space right behind it. Uh, you know, they used a spacer and whatever else dude said in the, in the early in the video. That's why I had him explain it. Because I know I wasn't going to remember. But yeah, this is what the new Spark looked like. And it only took an hour. So I ain't want to open my bike up on the way home. So I'm gonna just do what my buddy gonna do, just 
let it sit for a few days just because plus it's cold i don't like being cold but yeah this is it everybody has been asking uh questions about it in the community been looking know how i want to get put on it was one video that showed it but he didn't show how you know he didn't show it on the bike he just put them together and showed the similarities but this is it this new front sprocket permanent fix y'all there you go